Welcome to the Crazy Hat Chemist. Today is the 13th video in a series of 16, and today we're going to be talking about gas collection methods in the lab. We're going to discuss three of them here today. So real simply, here we go. Bam! So hydrogen gas collection. You can see that you can heat up something in a flask, and it has a tube attached to it, and it's um, collecting hydrogen gas. There's a pneumatic trough right there that's filled up with water, and then you basically have a test tube inverted that's filled up with water. Here's another way that you can do this, and you can take a, a, two, a flask of some kind, put some zinc and sulfuric acid in there, and it's also attached to this pneumatic trough and inverted gas collection too. There's the hydrogen gas that's being generated there, and it's, um, there's hydrogen gas at the top of the gas collection tube. And this is a water displacement by the gas. So it's displacing the water that's in the gas collection tube and pushing it out of there while the gas is filling it up. All right, that's one of them. Here's the second one. Here's oxygen gas collection. You should see there's a test tube filled up with some solid thing. You're going to heat that up. You have a pneumatic trough. You have an inverted container like a test tube. In this case, it's a, um, a glass container that's filled up with water. And this time, we're going to put potassium chlorate in here, heat this up, and then oxygen gas is generated here. This is also done by a water displacement of the gas. All right, that's number two. Number three is the gas collection of, of hydrogen gas also. And this is magnesium solid wrapped in a copper wire. And you're going to take a eudometer tube and flip it, invert it, and you have hydrochloric acid inside that eudometer tube originally. And that's going to also have hydrogen gas collected at the top. Here's a zoomed up feature of that special gas collecting tube. It's also hydrogen gas that's collected in there. This is also done by a water displacement method. Fantastic. There's three different methods of collecting gas in the laboratory. All water displacement. All right, so that was the 14th video. Sorry, that was the 13th video. You're waiting for the 14th video. And we will see you next time. See you later. Bye now.